Hi folks, we're back. What we're going to do now is to show you how to use hot plug to remove power that's already been plugged into a duplex wall outlet. It's real easy to do if you're uh, using hot plug in conjunction with a power strip, but in this case we are going to assume that the computer's been plugged directly into the wall and we'll use hot plug to help us remove this computer directly from the wall socket. We have an accessory called uh, the uh, uh, plug adapter uh, that can be used to remove it from the wall but in certain circumstances that option is not available to you. Uh, as an example, in Europe, uh, the uh, wall outlets are designed in such a way that it's impractical or impossible to use a plug adapter and you literally have to get to the wiring behind the wall socket in order to use hot plug. Anyway, it's actually it's easy to do. I'm going to show you how to do it. The tools that you need uh, are pretty simple. Uh, uh, pliers, insulated of course. A wire cutter, insulated of course. And whatever, and whatever screwdrivers you need to get uh, access to the plate. Okay, let's do it. We're going to use a hot plug now. Our computer in this case uh, is plugged in through a power strip to the wall, but it doesn't make any difference. Um, we have our hot plug product. We're going to plug our hot plug product into our UPS. Uh, we're going to plug the other end of our product directly into the wall outlet. We turn that on and we're not yet going to arm it because we're not ready to go. But what we are going to do is disassemble the wall outlet and get ourselves ready to go. Okay, we've removed the plate. We slide it out of the way. We now see that we have a standard duplex wall outlet. I should say, of course, that there are dangerous, if not lethal, voltages present inside. You shouldn't do this unless you've been trained how to do it. I have years worth of experience in my early days working as an electrician. So I do know how to do this. And uh, I'm going to show you. Okay, here's our standard duplex wall outlet. Once again, we've got the computer going in here and we have hot plug going to the other side of it. This wire is hot and this wire is our neutral and this is our ground. We care about those, but we care the most about the hot side. We now need to arm our product so it's ready to do its thing. And what I'm going to do once I've got an arm is simply cut the hot wire. Okay, we've cut the hot wire. There is no longer hot coming from the circuit, but you'll notice, going back to our computer, that the computer's up and running. We're going to end our little demonstration right here. If we were actually doing it uh, completely, we would now just simply cut the neutral wires and walk this whole assembly out of the building. We've used hot plug to seize a computer straight from a duplex wall outlet. Hi folks, we're back. What we want to do now is to show you how to use uh, clip adapters so that you can seize a computer uh, just by gaining access to its individual power wires. I have in my hand an adapter that we manufacture. The adapter is designed to hook up to hot plug. It has two of these clips on it. The black one is hot and the red one attaches to any neutral or ground. It has little insulating piercing points inside of it that allow you to hook directly to a cable. Once again, we've got a computer. Uh, it's plugged into a wall outlet, and for a variety of reasons, we've decided that the easiest way to seize this computer is to attach directly to its power leads. So we're just going to do it. We're attaching our adapter directly to hot plug. We've already plugged hot plug into a UPS, and we've gone to the trouble to take the power cable and slit the sheath. You can see here that the sheath has just been opened up, and I removed the three power leads. You can do that with an X-Acto knife, or preferentially, you can do it with a sheath splitting tool. Uh, now we're taking a look at that, and we're going to identify our hot, neutral, and ground. This black is our hot, the green is our ground, we really don't care about that, and the white is our neutral. We're going to attach the neutral polarity first to the red clip. We simply insert it here, and allow the Pomona clip to do its thing. Now we're going to take the hot side, and we're going to attach that to there. There we go. Now let's take a look at the hot plug. You can see that the output light has come on. 
I'm going to grab my electrical tape and use my electrical tape to secure this. There's no rush here since uh, uh, we've already put in mouse jiggler and the computer's not going to go to sleep. We just take our electrical tape here and run a couple rounds around there. I'm not even going to cut the electrical tape off. Once again, we observe that the output is on. We've turned hot plug on. We've armed it, and I walk over to the outlet from the wall, and you'll see that the computer's still turned on. At this point, the procedure is identical to what we've already explained to you. Hot plug is once again worked using the cable adapter clips.